Ah, gear up. It's a car behind me, but we're not going anywhere. There we go. All right. Woo. And see, look, right after that, the light went green. That light goes red. That's just stupid. Oh well. Oh, this road is not in good shape. Woo. See if we can ride no hands. Yeah, I'm totally off topic here. I need to stay on topic. Um, so why ride multi-speed? Well, I'm drawing a blank. Maybe I'm a not a good advocate for multi-speed. You can keep your cadence constant. You want to keep your cadence constant because you'll be most efficient that way. And I really don't like that term efficient though because a lot of people use it and honestly what it comes down to is Whatever might be efficient for somebody might not be efficient for another person. Because, you know, maybe your best cadence is 90 or 70 or 60 even. Uh, it just depends on your body. Some people are stronger muscularly. Some people are just genetically better uh, aerobically, you know, for spinning faster. It's just a, just a thought. Oh, I got all the lights on in the park here, but uh, I don't think anything's going on, although maybe there is a ball game going on over there. See a bunch of cars in the parking lot. It's a little late though, Thursday night, 10 o'clock. I was surprised, I thought all the lights would be turned off here. Because I know for sure, gear down, in the winter, um, these lights aren't turned on, obviously probably because, you know, people don't play outside in the winter time when it's so cold. But I remember riding through here in the pitch black. Okay. So multi-speed will allow you. I mean, there's so many advantages to single speed though. Oh. I think part of the um, draw to multi-speed, other than the fact you, know, you keep a constant cadence or RPM, revolutions permitted or uh, gear down, or uh, relative ease in your cycling is that, uh, you know, you feel like you have more control over the bike. You know, you, you can touch something on the bike and make something happen. I think there's a strong draw to that for human beings. We like to be in control. And when you're riding on a single speed bike, you only have one gear. So you aren't really in control of the bike. At least, you know, the gear determines the workout, not the, uh, the user. But I will say that uh, with, um, lost my train of thought, gear up. I'm a little hungry, I haven't had dinner yet. I'm just mashing this hill. Woo! Oh. There's nothing better than the feeling of propelling yourself around this world under your own power. <clears throat> Even when you want to make it a little easier with the gear. Ah. Oh.
I have been um, thinking about possibly adding or turning one of my other bikes into a one by bike. <laughs> but I don't know about that. I honestly, you probably noticed, I mean, I've maybe shifted in this video gears up and down probably a dozen or so times. I've not shifted that often. It is just so nice though to be able to shift down a couple and up a couple. Um, which is why I think I would almost be a, a better candidate for a, maybe a five speed uh, bike, you know. Five speed, uh, I guess down at that size it'd be a freewheel on the rear of the bike, but I, I mean, someone asked, like, why didn't I do a 11 speed with my 11 speed hub? Well, it's like, you know, it's already quite a lot of gears to to uh, shift through. Um, so, you know, why would I want more gears to have to shift through? I think nine is plenty. You could probably even go eight. And now I'm thinking five may actually be fine. You, know, you just gotta pick the right, you know, cog size, the right gear size on the back. And uh, it should all work out. Nobody around. This is the way I like it. The only problem with riding at night are the greater chance of drunk drivers and drunk bicyclists or cyclists. For those who uh, believe you should only use the term bicycle in the form of a noun. Woo. No one behind me at all. I can just zigzag all over like I'm drunk. <laughs> uh, i make a left here. Wait for this joker. Make a left without crashing. All right, they got the lights on over here too. So why else would you ride multi-speed? Again, I mean, it's, there's a big positive to having another speed. So it's easier to start from a stop. I mean, honestly, you can start faster from a stop, which is awesome. So, I mean, I think that actually part of the draw to single speed, I know this isn't about single speed, but it's just, you know, less, less stuff to go wrong, you know? But uh, honestly, the difference between this bike I'm riding and my, multi, or my single speed bikes, I got a cassette, which, you know, that doesn't add a lot of weight, really. It doesn't really complicate things very much. The heart of it really is the rear derailleur and, you know, having a, another shift, you know, another cable. But with putting the shift, the shifter on the down tube, it's sort of out of my way. But, uh, I don't know. So if, if you do have a, a single speed bike and you sort of feel like you might want to go multi-speed, I'd really suggest doing what I did. Now this is sort of me talking here, of course, but the down tube shifter, I love it. I mean, it's like, it's out of the way. So my bike still looks really nice and clean. Um, and if I want to shift, I have the ability to do so. Like there, you know. Um, so, I mean, it is really cool. Um, so I guess that's why I like multi-speed. I mean, just you have more options, but with my specific setup, one by nine, is just less extra stuff. Now, I sort of touched on this in a previous video, but uh, let's go up this way. Nobody around. But uh, if you're gonna have a lot of hills around where you live, that's where it really is beneficial to have 
another chain ring. So, anyway, those are just my thoughts. I do like my multi-speed. Look left. But, uh, uh, it's really quiet right now. Not a lot going on. Not a lot going on. Woo! So do I like single speed or multi-speed more? Well, I have been riding my multi-speed bike more here. So that in of self may be proof, except uh, I still very much like my single speed. So that's why it's always the good, good to have multiple bikes, depending on how you're feeling that day. Dead end. <laughs> 